Alright, what's going on guys and welcome back. So a lot of people have been talking about this and I wanted to make a video on it, but some stuff came up, but we're here. So do you have to pay for starters in Tales of Tenorio and how do you get starters? So obviously you get a starter when you start the game, but if you want other starters, there is a way to obtain them. But unfortunately you have to pay with Robux, which if you don't already know, includes real life money. So if you go to the uh, Pokemon Center equivalent and go up to the shop upstairs, you have the option of buying a couple of incenses. One of them is specific to essentially making starters appear in the overworld and it costs 250 Robux to use. Using it is supposed to make the starters appear as overworld spawns. However, with the game being as buggy as it is, I actually did run one of these and absolutely nothing happened. I restarted the game and tried again and still nothing happened. So essentially, I just wasted a little bit of money on it. So I honestly don't recommend buying these right now because you might end up losing your incense and just wasting money on it. Now, that being said, I have heard people say that they've found starters in ruptures. I cannot confirm that this. I haven't really delved into the rupture mechanic too much. I'm not a big fan of raids from Pokemon either, so it didn't really interest me. But what I will say is that regardless of whether or not they can be found through an ulterior sort of slower and not as consistent method, I do find that this does end up being a major pay for convenience type thing, which in my opinion, at least is inadvertently pay to win because you can spend a lot less time looking for something that you need to be competitive and spend the rest of your time honing your competitive skills while other people are just grinding. Also, I just wanted to say another thing some people have said is that the price point is just a glitch and you're supposed to be able to buy them and you're supposed to be able to buy them with in-game money. I feel like if that was the case, this would have been one of the first things patched, but maybe I'm wrong about that and it will be changed in the future. But yeah, that being said, that's how you get additional starters in Tales of Tenorio. I'm not really a fan of this. I definitely feel like the incenses should be something that you can buy with in-game currency and also shouldn't bug out and not work to the point where, you know, people are losing money on them, especially right now with how buggy the game is. I feel like they should be only available with in-game currency so people don't accidentally spend real money and not actually get what they paid for. But yeah, guys, other than that, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe for daily monster taming videos. Special thanks to my patrons, especially Jim Hamilton, Dro Ghost, Candy Marunzi, Trigsoft, and Nemo, and I'll see you next time. Peace.